Here are some RGB LEDs, red, green, blue. Um, it is a five meter long strip, 30 LEDs per meter. The strip costs $26 on Amazon. Uh, there it was, uh, it's the Alatove, Alatove brand. There are some that are a couple dollars less for five meters, but th this brand has uh, better ratings. It is being run by a microbit that is plugged into a bit booster extension board so they can get at the pins easier. Technically just to run one thing, I didn't need uh, the, the bit booster, but the micro bit only wants three volts. And I was really worried about whether three volts could power 150 LEDs. I will try that coming up, but my AAA batteries are, are dead apparently so I didn't have anything to power the uh, the micro bit um, even just just I know that if I just plug in the USB from the computer these don't light up with all the colors I do know that I just to give you a little comparison I will plug in a smaller just a 30 uh, LED strip I like the extension boards that have extra power, like the Bit Booster actually has 4.5 volts. The Maker Bit, you can plug in anything 6 to 12, I believe. And they will only route 3 volts to the Micro Bit. But the rest is now accessible to other ports. I know most of the ports on the Maker Bit are 5 volts. It'll route all the power available to the motors. And so that's, that allows you to power some servos and power a bunch of NeoPixels um, all at once. So here is, I'm going to plug in this tiny strip of, uh, these, are act, these are actually, I think, NeoPixels. Um, important thing, ground and power, you, there is an order you should have best practice to plug and unplug them. Always unplug power first. Power is like a last and first kind of thing. And then you can pull anything. Now, when I'm plugging it in, I want to plug in ground first. I don't want to plug in power without, without a ground. So plug in ground first. Then I'm going to plug in the signal because that's actually the information that's needed. Um, otherwise, the strip wouldn't know what to do. And then I'm going to last plug in power. So there's a smaller strip, only 30 um, LEDs. And I just have a simple code on here that just says, uh, put a rainbow on there and um, rotate the, the, the LEDs uh, by one. So if it's red here, then it's going to change over to red here, and then it's going to walk it kind of around. So there's some LEDs run by BitBooster and a microbit.